afraid of getting to the free throw line because you've got confidence your guys are going to knock them down. And the Pacers with possession here. It's a three-point game. Jordan the pass to Parker. And that one's good. Parker's got five points so far. He had his choice of finishing moves there, and you just got to love the fact he went old school with the finger on Lamb dishes to Ibaka. No luck. So Indiana will take it the other way. Outside Jordan, and they double up Jordan. Drops in the layup for two. 14 points for him. Well, with that last title, you could see the coach was addressing how they were going to make a tactical adjustment. And after the coach does something like that, it's on the players now to lock in and follow the lead and execute. If they don't, then the coach will put them on the pot. Now, Parker following Durant's three-point attempt. You know, even from here, you can see that one pretty clearly. Yep, pretty obvious. And a good call by the official. Pacers have made three free throws so far. Haven't missed any. That free throw, no good. A different look for Oklahoma City. McGarry's checked in for Adams. For Serge Ibaka. And it's Frazier in for Kevin Durant. And Indiana with a change here, too. George is checked in for West. He hits the second from the line. Oklahoma City trailing. Here's Lamb. He had a 12-point outing in their last game against Dallas. Westbrook passes to Houston. Back to Westbrook. Fades back, and that one's good. Westbrook's got eight. He's having quite the quarter here, guys. I mean, shooting the ball extremely well. For Indiana, they've gone eight of 12 on field goal attempts so far. And it's Bryant in the corner. He had stolen by Lamb. Lays it up and banks it in. And the Thunder lead by two. And the lead goes right back over. This is a seesaw affair. The game's there for the taking, but neither team seems to want it. Here's Parker. No good. And Oklahoma City will go with it the other way. They want to keep it rolling here following the win against Dallas. And they played outstanding team defense in that win, Clark. Nobody got stuck on an island. Everybody was helping. Uh, great rotations. 14. It really looked like they were together in that game. Yeah, and even when they were rotating different players in and out, Steve, um, I thought their communication was five-star and the teamwork was very strong. And so here is Indiana following the score by Oklahoma City. And George, here we go. Bryant has the open look. Here's Mahimi. Outside Jordan. Now here is George. 17 points for him last game against the Timberwolves in Minneapolis. And he did some nice work on the boards too, Kevin. That was definitely a factor in that game as well. I don't think there's much more you can ask of a player to start the game. I mean, he's six for seven early. And here is Lamb following the three from Jordan. Frazier kicks to Westbrook. And they come right back with their own three-pointer. Westbrook's got 11 points. This is great. Three-pointers going down quickly at both ends. Yeah, it took them no time to answer back on that possession. Jordan inside. Frazier covering. Parker with another miss. The Thunder leading by four. It's Westbrook with the drive. And it comes off the front of the rim. Indiana's gone three of five from three-point land so far in the ballgame. Outside Jordan. Fade away. And there's Bryant. That's good on the assist by Jordan. Whatever their plan was defensively that time, it, it didn't work. Not if it results in that shot. Hey, listen up. We got to push the ball, all right? First thing we got to do is rebound. 
And then I want everybody getting out. Feel the light. One ladies check in for Jeremy Lane. Indiana also making some changes. Xavier Henry, he's checked in for Kobe. And George Hills subbed in for Tony Parker. One forty-one left in the first quarter. McGarry kicks to Westbrook. Here's McGarry. He's had some playing time, but no scoring yet from him. Beautiful feed off the bounce to his teammate there. Nicely done. Pacers trail by four. They set the pick. Here's George. And the dunk to finish it off. A ah, beauty. Well, that's a solidly executed pick play. I mean, it paid dividends with that nice dunk. Exactly the result they were looking for. Yeah, it worked so well. I mean, he got set and did not shuffle his feet. Really well done there offensively. Here's Westbrook following the score by Indiana. Again, Oklahoma City. Pretty much all of their buckets coming from inside the paint now. Yeah, that's five of their last six baskets inside the lane. They have really established themselves inside. Now here is Hill. Right now averaging five points a game. Oh, Maestro, he is so good at making those lead passes, like conducting an orchestra. 51 seconds left here in the first quarter. Westbrook dishes to Dunley. Out to the right wing. All alone. Misses off the left iron. And here's George. Right now averaging 11 points a game. Hill, no good. Terrific job that time defending at the rim. I mean, it's not an easy task stopping that fella when he's headed to the bucket like that. Good job. Three seconds separate the shot clock and game clock. Westbrook passes to Frazier. Here's McGarry, an easy two points on the layup. McGarry's got his first bucket of the night. George up top. Got it from 16 feet. Puts up a prayer. No luck. And so both teams trading buckets as we end the first quarter. Thunder lead by two. And the second quarter about to get started. We'll be back in just a moment. Coming up Tuesday, November 22nd, the Indiana Pacers take on Dante Exum and the Utah...